Hey everyone, this video is created for those people who are completely new to Ruby in Grails and want to learn how to connect PostgreSQL to Groovy and Grails. So, for the starters, I will show you how to do that. So, in this, I will show you how to create a project on Groovy and Grails. So, first of all, I will create, I will open a CMD. Grails create app mm -hmm. Hello. with name Hello. my app. Okay. Oh, my bad. Grails create app. I'm hoping that you Hello. have created Grails app. So app is created. Let's open it in IntelliJ. App is created. I'm gonna open it in IntelliJ. Let's add. Let's close all browsers. I trust this project. Okay, now what's next? Let's check if this programs work. Grills run app. It's resolving the dependencies. Until then, let's first open the notes that I have prepared for sending for oh sorry. For adding Postgre to database, yes, I do store data. I do write codes. You should do that too, because not everything should be remains in our head. Okay, let's wait for few minutes. Okay, until then okay so it's done let's check yes it's working okay now let's first create our database and post create because there are few things that are that we are needed to create a database which are username password and the JDBC URL this host this local host um, so okay um, I'm logging it with my credentials and then this App, my app, password, 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 e -A -S -S okay. privileges, can log in, super, save, Let's create a database with name I am database. Change the owner to my app. Okay, everything is fine. I have created the database and the role user. So this is clear, this is clear. And in this, I will be adding post key on it. My database, 
my app database my app database okay and same for the second one okay let's copy it down first in the application.yml page oh my I forgot that first put this code in the build.gradle search on that search here and you will see this a uh, small section write it down build gradle it will show you all the list copy this implementation i will sh share it to you in the description of this video and then copy this data source and paste it in application dot yml okay it's in grail app config first search the data source okay here is the data source paste it app my app username my app okay the same password that i have put on this when on this properties definition you can enter the password in this and where are we now this password is completed true true okay next put this code in environment development okay so in the development section you have to put this code db create update don't forget to put it update my database test admin change it to my app my database my app database and now save it so okay this is done both are the done now you what you have to do is just stop the program so we'll see terminate the program clear the dependencies and control rg i think it's this compile first clear this dependency what was that clear dependencies i think i might have forgotten the correct word or this is the correct one okay it's successful now compile clear dependencies now again resolve dependencies dependencies okay my, my bad okay let's compile uh -huh. control alt g compile might have done this work okay now fails run i might have to rerun the program if this doesn't work okay so let's go to grails main create domain this my app domain okay new grids domain my app hmm. 
think there's an issue. Let's check the issue. Okay, unable to load post create I will so I think we have to reopen the program. Returning the program. We open the program. This app. So, अभी तक आपने registration नहीं किया है? आप करता हो गया है? आप ठीक रहेंगे। मैं आपसे इसलिए कंफर्म कर रहा हूँ क्योंकि जो सीटें हैं ना वो मेरे भी 90 परसेंट से भी ज़्यादा फुल हो चुकी हैं ठीक है अभी मैं आप पुराना डेटा देख रहा हूँ दो so new domain is created. Next, what you have to do is mapping for the table. So, static mapping table name स्टूडेंट ले सकते Now let's see in the program and see if this is visible on PostgreSQL or not. तो आप रजिस्ट्रेशन करोगे तो आपको कॉल किया जाएगा एक फॉर्म आ गया आपको सर्कुलेट किया जाएगा जिंदा है एडमिशन का सेंड कर सकते हैं ठीक है ओह माय गॉड तो 
Now it's done. Okay, this is working. Now let's check the table. Refresh the database. Refresh. And let's check the tables. Okay, my domain is exist. Let's check the properties. So version, username, first name and last. Oh my. So. Thank you so much for today and I hope you like this video. See you again. Hey everyone, this video is sponsored by Sachin and his co-workers. <laughs> ah.